G'day everyone, Dougal here with a community update for you. This week we're going to pause our series from 1 Thessalonians and we're going to feature the work of our mission partner, the Church Mission Society. John Lovell, Executive Director, is going to be joining us and we're also going to have updates from Martin and Julie Field from Argentina and Tanya and Mike Snowden from Valencia, so stay tuned for that. On Saturday, September 18, Lydia and Paul Russell have organised a church-wide Zoom trivia night for us. As well as having some fun, the idea is that we support one of our mission partners, Open Doors, in their efforts in Afghanistan. All of the details that you'll need are listed in the description below, but let me highlight a few of those now. To participate, we need you to register. The link to the registration form is listed below. Once you've completed the registration form, you'll receive the Zoom call details. As well as registering, we're asking each participating household to make a minimum $10 donation directly to the Open Doors Afghanistan Appeal. Please continue to pray for Kate and Dave Horn as they lead our Christianity Explored course. Please pray for warm discussion and also that participants will be convicted by the love and the Lordship of Jesus Christ. Finally, on September 22, the whole of the Sydney Anglican Diocese is coming together to pray for our city. Archbishop Kanishka Rafal will be opening God's word for us and I commend this event to you. All the details you need for that event are listed in the description. Now, let me leave you with my memory verse for this week. It comes from James chapter 1. Blessed is the one who perseveres under trial, because having stood the test, that person will receive the crown of life that the Lord has promised to those who love him. So keep standing firm in Jesus, everyone. And remember, please do make contact if we can be helpful. I look forward to seeing you all really soon.